Hi, Vos. How are you? Um, I saw this film d- during LFF at oh, the London you? Film Festival, and it really has stuck with me up till now. Uh, Jodie, can, can I start by asking you, did you read the book before agreeing to be part of this project? Yeah, well, I'd actually read the script first, yeah. so I, I wasn't familiar with Megan's book, but I had received the script and with Mahalia's name attached. Um, loved the script, huge fan of Alice's, and then I yeah, and then I read the novel and was just blown away by how oh, so simple but so poetic and profound it was. And then I met with May and we had conversations about you know my instincts, mm-hmm. what May's vision was. Mm-hmm. Um, and the the story just felt incredibly intimate. Yeah. Um, and I loved how May wanted to depict um, motherhood and that first year of parenthood that you speak so beautifully about, you know, this, it was just, it felt very, very nuanced. And um, I knew that May wanted to be very naturalistic and very raw and not shy away from the difficult parts, and yeah, I was really excited by that. What was it about her that, do, do you find any um, similarities between you mm. and your character at all in the way that you approach the world? Mm, that's a good question. Mm. I feel like, it's funny because I feel like throughout, I think she feels very different from me. Like, I think she's very introverted. Mm. She's not very outgoing. She's listens more than she speaks. She's lazy, <laughs> Which is not me. She's lazy. She's lazy, but I am actually quite lazy. I don't know that about you. Yeah, I'm quite lazy. I'm quite lazy know. and I'm quite messy. I, don't, I find it very hard to believe. Uh, <laughs> no, I... Trust me, I, I, yeah, I am. Um, but how she sees... How she goes about the world... Um, I mean, I've always... You know, since doing these interviews, like, I like to think that I would find the resilience that she has. Mm. You know, I think there's probably a steeliness that she has that is within me somewhere that I've brought out um, whether I would handle this as well as she would, I don't know. Um, but yeah, yeah, probably a steeliness. Mahali, I, I just want to, I, I, during the uh, London Film Festival, I went to the, the gala premiere for the, your oh, movie. You? And Sorry, Jodie, you weren't there because no, obviously yeah. for good reason. Cause mm-hmm. you I were, love that. You were I sticking. love that day. Yeah, uh, but th- I, I remember very vividly taking a photo of all of you on stage yeah. and an array of extraordinary wi- women that I felt like I I, I wanted to, to stop because 10 years before that, I don't think we would have seen such a, a big team that was dominated by women. How did that feel for you? I mean, I just, I actually, I loved that. I loved having everyone up there. I, I'm so sad you guys weren't mm. there, but but just having all, because it actually gave a chance for everyone behind the scenes to be there. And it felt for me, that was like the coming home of the movie because I'd been into different countries with yeah. it. but. Um, seeing everybody there was quite amazing, and in terms of, I mean, yeah, I had a brilliant, I had a brilliant HODs, a brilliant crew, and yeah, it's great. I mean, I think I do work with a lot of women, mm. just as a kind of mm. sort of by accident. Mm. You know, there's just something that sort of kind of <coughs> you know, happens that way, but it's just because they were right mm-hmm. for this. What was it about Megan's book that you wanted to be part of this uh, this project? It, it was it was um, evocative for me in a way that I wasn't... I, when I f- read it the first time, I wasn't expecting. It sort of brought up a lot of different feelings and images. She writes in these kind of beautiful poem, you know, poetry. Yeah. It's brilliant images. And that stuck with me for a while. But actually later, I read Alice Birch's script, which is this, oh. this kind of uh, really well-written, you know, script that... Um, and I read it just after I had locked down with a new baby. Mm. And suddenly the whole story spoke to me in an entirely different way. way. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Jodie, I think this is the first time that sort of you've undertaken a project like this. And is it the kind of thing that you are, you want to do more of, like stuff that's related to motherhood or to, to female sentiment, really? Oh, female sentiment. Hell yeah. <laughs> like, give me it all. <laughs> Um, I think as well, like being being a part of an independent film in this way, and just like really seeing firsthand how much work and passion <laughs> goes into them, and how much hurdles along the yeah, way. Yeah, you're you in have the to... trenches. <laughs> yeah, like it's a it's a lot. You know, there's a lot of things that come up along the way that you, especially as you know, as a director or you know, kind of leading the pack, like you have to navigate and make difficult choices and. 
so to see this film come out in its entirety and in, in, in this kind of beautiful way is I feel incredibly proud of it. So I'd love to continue working with people like Mahalia who genuinely really um, have integrity and care about what it is that they're making. Uh, we see Benedict Cumberbatch very briefly. Is, that, is he also involved in the, in the production side of the? Or it's is his he, company. Yeah, mm. it's his company. So, I, I, what was it like working on on on? So I don't know. Where, where did you film? I quite liked it, didn't yeah. you? Yeah. yeah, that was I, that was just outside of London somewhere. But he came in. He was there. We had this part that we had to turn three characters into to one. one. Mm. And and he was, you know, graciously came on to help us, and and it was great. He took mm. that character and made him brilliant. I think we had yeah. one brilliant day, and I was just kind of sitting watching. I just had the joy of sitting watching him do it. I yeah. was like, wow, he finds the truth every single time. Yeah. Um, but it was a really beautiful day. It was like a, a, we'd been filming for a little while. It was a Friday. Um, it was a lit, like a and we filming late into the night when we when we had the kind of dance yeah. dance sequence. There was a full moon. <laughs> it was all very. It was a lot of energy that day, yeah. it but it was great. He's a wonderful actor. He's a wonderful man. Mm. Yeah. Uh, I, having worked on this uh, title, um, are there any sort of working on new film together again? Or oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> No. Can you, can, you, can you say yeah. it? She, she uh, we're done, right? We're yes. finished. Thank you. <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> I'd love to. I would love to. Yeah. Thank you yeah, very much. Well, thank I really, you. I absolutely love the film, and I, I read, the, I had read the book ages ago. Oh, did so you? I thought it really stuck to what to the essence of the idea. So yeah, thank oh, you very much. So much. Again. Lovely Cheers. to meet you. Yeah, take care. Well. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys. <laughs> hey, you guys. <laughs> hey, that's what they all say. Hey, you guys.